coming up on today's episode of Airborne Unlimited. SNF Innovation Preview announced. Aerox introduces Boomula O2 delivery system. Diamond Aeromot partnership to assemble DA62s in Brazil. Welcome to Airborne Unlimited. I'm your host, Holland Lee. Let's get into today's stories. SNF Innovation Preview announced. The Sun and Fun Aerospace Expo is proud to present, as the lead-in to the aviation year via its partnership with the Aero News Network, the upcoming 2023 Sun and Fun Innovation Preview. The aviation world is driven by new developments in technology and innovation, and focusing the entire Aeroverse right at the start of 2023 on all that is cool, interesting, innovative, important, and pivotal is the ultimate aim of the 2023 Sun and Fun Innovation Preview. Upwards of 20 innovation presenters will be featured in individual, no more than five-minute snippets, one per company, and will feature only Sun and Fun exhibitors and vendors with new products and programs to announce, or otherwise to be seen for the first time in 2023. The resulting multi-hour program will air live Tuesday afternoon, March 28th, via Sun and Fun, Aero News, and other outlets. All will be made available for rewebcast by interested news organizations, while each presentation will be logged on ANN, Sun and Fun, and other web channels for easy reference and redistribution. ANN will be syndicating our live coverage to dozens of popular media and aviation sites, such as YouTube, Vimeo, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Roku, Fire TV, and many others. Interest and excitement is quite high, and ANN hopes it may turn out to be one of the most significant aviation news events of 2023. More info to come. And after the break, GoGo 5G chip passes critical review. Well, hello, fellow pilots. I'm John King. And I'm Martha King. You know, we've all had our flying lives disrupted lately. Well, King Schools is here to help you stay up to date with courses that you can access on your desktop, iPad, or iPhone. If you'd like a refresher or just want to expand your aviation horizons, we have a course for you. So head over to kingschools.com slant rusty today for details. Unbridled passion, unequaled performance, unlimited possibilities. Hartzell Aviation, you are cleared for takeoff. Introducing Hartzell Aviation, leading general aviation companies united by the Hartzell guiding principle of built on honor. A commitment to uphold the highest standards in quality, performance, and support. Hartzell Propeller, Hartzell Engine Tech, Hartzell Aerospace Welding. We are Hartzell Aviation. Now boarding at HartzellAviation.com. Are you tired of tucking your phone under your headset to make a call and having cords and adapters strewn about the cockpit? Experience wireless cell phone communications and your personal music with Pilot Communications Blue Link 2. Blue Link 2 gives you a wearable link to two Bluetooth enabled devices at the same time and can even control your phone and music. Use Blue Link 2 with your existing headset or a Pilot Communications headset from pilot-usa.com. Welcome back. Now let's take a trip around the patch for some other interesting stories. GoGo 5G chip passes critical review. GoGo recently announced it had completed and deployed the entirety of its 150 site nationwide 5G network. Regrettably, Samsung announced that it had discovered a manufacturing error in the first production run of its 5G chips, a salient component of GoGo's 5G aspirations. The South Korean tech giant subsequently estimated initial deliveries of the chips would be delayed until mid-2023. There is now confirmation that Samsung's 5G chips have passed a critical design review and are now in fabrication with deliveries expected to commence mid-year. NTSB further impugns Ethiopian 737 MAX accident final report. The NTSB has just released additional comments pertaining to the Ethiopian Aircraft Investigation Bureau's final report on the loss of Ethiopian Airlines Flight 302. The new comments issued to the attention of the EAIB's investigator in charge reasserted the NTSB's concerns about several of the findings in the EAIB's final accident report and reiterated the board's conclusion that EAIB investigators failed to comprehensively assess the accident's human performance aspects. The NTSB has argued the EAIB's final report contains findings not supported by empirical evidence. Slowing business aircraft market begets opportunism. 
Notwithstanding fourth quarter 2022 reports of robust transaction numbers and rising prices, the demand for new and used business aircraft looks to be flattening in 2023. Analysts describe the slowdown to economic pressures, primary among which are worsening global recession, soaring interest rates, and the widespread eradication of discretionary income resultant of record high inflation. Condemnation of private aircraft travel by environmental zealots and politicians eager to portray themselves in shades of green has also adversely impacted the business aircraft market. NASA and DARPA to develop nuclear thermal spacecraft engine NASA and DARPA announced a collaboration to demonstrate a nuclear thermal rocket engine in space. Such engines, fully developed and thoroughly vetted, might one day power NASA manned missions to Mars. NASA will join DARPA's Demonstration Rocket for Agile Cislunar Operations Program, an initiative undertaken in 2021 for purpose of developing a nuclear thermal engine by which an experimental DARPA-designed spacecraft will eventually be powered. Subject agreement grants NASA final authority over the nuclear thermal rocket engine's development and fabrication. That's it for today's trip around the patch. Let's get back to the rest of the news. Aerox introduces Boomula O2 delivery system. Aerox Aviation Oxygen Systems LLC has brought to market a unique headset accessory to which it has ascribed the memorable appellation Boomula, a portmanteau that concisely describes the product's structure and purpose, a headset-mounted boom terminating in an oxygen cannula. Compatible with most continuous flow portable and installed aircraft oxygen systems, the Boomula mounts to any aviation headset and connects directly to extant aircraft oxygen flow meters. In addition to the device's integral stick-on cup mountable boom and O2 cannula, Aerox ships each Boomula with a hard mount compatible with Bose's popular A20 headset and an Aerox OxySaver pendant. The latter product is an altitude-compensated oxygen-conserving device that affords up to 75% savings of supplemental oxygen. The OxySaver pendant increases oxygen flow duration by up to eight times, is compatible with Aerox flow control and other oxygen systems capable of delivering low O2 flow, and features soft nasal prongs for enhanced comfort. The device is designed for oxygen delivery up to 18,000 feet MSL. Good-looking and easy-to-use Aerox's Boomula is a simple and effective solution to one of general aviation's most insidious and lethal dangers, hypoxia. ANN will have a test report shortly. And after these messages, Diamond Aeromont partnership to assemble DA-62s in Brazil. Throughout the globe, Piper Aircraft has hand-selected the very best in company representation, service, and support. From first inquiry to acquisition to product support, Piper Aircraft ownership is seamless and worry-free. Piper Aircraft authorized dealers, factory trained, factory connected. Skyleader Aircraft offers a lineup of the most powerful, durable, and efficient light sport aircraft in the industry. From trainers to roomy cockpits for long hauls, Skyleader has an aircraft for you. And the best part? They're in your budget. Skyleader's base prices are set low to give you room to customize your aircraft to your needs, desires, and wallet, allowing you to put your money where it matters to you most. Visit flyskyleader.com today to learn about our aircraft, customization options, and chat with the team. Welcome back. Diamond Aeromont partnership to assemble DA-62s in Brazil. Diamond Aircraft has signed an agreement by which Aeromont, the company's Brazil-based sales partner, will assemble DA-62 aircraft in Porto Alegre, Brazil, under license from Diamond Aircraft Canada. Per the licensing agreement, Diamond Aircraft Canada will provide the DA-62 kits and ongoing support. Upon completion, the Brazilian-assembled DA-62 aircraft will be delivered to Aeromont sales territory, which includes Brazil, Argentina, Paraguay, and Uruguay. Collectively, Diamond Aircraft and Aeromont aspire to see production of Brazilian-built DA-62 aircraft surpass 50 units per year. Diamond Aircraft Canada CEO Kevin Chang stated, quote, The global demand for general aviation aircraft is huge, especially the Brazilian and South American market in general has seen a strong growth, and we believe that now is the right time to look for opportunities to expand production and sales in this region, end quote. Aramont CEO Guillermo Cuna added, quote, We are very proud to announce this agreement with Diamond Aircraft, strengthening our partnership started back in 2016. 
The Brazilian market has the key attributes for general aviation growth, and the DA-62 perfectly fits the user's needs." End quote. Deliveries of Brazilian-assembled DA-62 aircraft are expected to commence in 2025. And that's our show for today. You can catch episodes of Airborne on YouTube, Roku, or Fire TV. Just search for Aero News or Airborne, and don't forget to follow us on social media. Thanks for watching!